Yo, what is up guys? Zorin here with another Pokemon Scarlet and Binding BGC video. Hopefully you guys are doing well. Now today, I am bringing you a team by Coco down in the Pokesports Discord. Uh, uh, thank you for the code, uh, Coco. Appreciate it. Sorry, I'm a little hot right now and I am, I have like 30 fans flying at me right now because it's so damn hot. Hopefully it's not too hot for you guys, but... Uh, today we're bringing you a Dialga team, but not only just a Dialga team, there's a Brixen on this team. And the last time I used Brixen, Brixen actually did really, really well as a support. So I'm really excited to see if Brixen can still hold up in a restricted format. We do have um, Rillaboom and Urshifu here as some hard hitters of the meta to help us with the Woodhammer, Grassy Glide, U-Turn, Fake Out on the Rillaboom with the Assault Vest. Pretty standard Rillaboom. And we do have the Urshifu with Circle Punch, Wicked Blow, Claws, Combat, and Protect. Now... Something to note is that I've seen a lot of U-turns on the Rillabooms. And one thing to note is that there's Maridons all over the place. So I would like to see more Rillabooms with high horsepower, please. If you're not going to have another way to deal with it besides the August Draco Meteor, <laughs> I would really appreciate it. Because having to deal with um, Maridon and having no answers is always such a problem. But anyways, that's just a little gripe for me for every time I see a Rillaboom right now. Uh, Gallade is running a sharpness with clear amulet, psycho cut, sacred sword, trick room, and white guard. So really being our other trick room setter and also our white guard support. We do have Suicune here with Snarl Scale oh, sc I was about to say sc scaled. Scald, Icy Wind, Tailwind, some speed control if you would rather go that route instead of Trick Room. And we do have the Dialga here with the Adamant Crystal that changes its form to the Super Dialga and it has Draco Meteor, Steel Beam, Earth Power and Trick Room, so no protect on it. So yeah, we'll see what we can do with this thing, with this team. There is literally almost no protects besides Urshifu. So you know what that means. We we have to play out of our absolute mind when there's no trick, where there's barely any protects, especially because most of that no protects is because there's no uh, there's a choice fan or scarf. So yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens. But yeah, just a little gripe though with Rillaboons right now is having no high horsepower when we're right on exists. Uh, I really have to rely on Diago to take out those Maridons, so I just like having second. Two options instead of one, but that's just me. Alright, let's 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 get right into it though. Okay, we are up against a Zamazenta team, but it has a Tyranitar, which is really cool. Wait, is this a team that we've seen on tournaments? I don't think so. I think it's like a variant with it, at least with the Tyranitar, because everything else I've seen on a Zamazenta team. Ha uh ha -huh. ha. Uh huh. Okay. 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 What can we do here? What can we do with this team? Hmm. I think we need Rillaboom here. Rillaboom is like a must here. So is the. Hmm. The white card would be really nice to have here. I just don't want to get hit by a fake out. Would be very very important. Oh, you know what? Zamazenta's probably gonna be leading. Zamazenta leading, and we're, we're probably the slower Rillaboom. That's the problem. Oh, wait, 117 speed? Maybe not. Maybe not. I'm thinking we just do these two. Uh, can we bring this? You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna bring it. The Willow is my my coming clutch. If worst comes to worst, we can at least burn it, burn the Zamazenta. I, I think maybe it was it was Urshifu because if we can get them to to terastalize the the Zamazenta into like something that doesn't resist dark, that would have been pretty good too. Yeah, so there's that. What I thought I would see, but I think that's okay. I think that's okay right now. That's actually pretty good for me here. Okay, so it was speed, I believe. We have Steel Beam. Okay, gotta remember that. Yeah, yeah, okay. Damages me, so okay. I gotta remember that. We have Grass Terra. I think I could go safely for a Trick Room Fake Out. 
Oh, if he has Trick Room on this, I'm gonna cry. That might be why he let it. Okay, it's just I see. I mean, yeah, I kind of want that. I kind of like that. Thank you. Appreciate you. I I I I wasn't faster than you. I I wasn't. I'm cool with this. Thank you. I absolutely am okay with that. Thank you very much. I don't think an Earth Power KOs it. Grass Terra doesn't look bad here either though. So I think I am gonna add Grass Terra here. I'm just gonna go for Earth Power on this slot and I'm gonna go for a Wood Hammer on the uh on the Flutter main. Because I don't think Earth Power KOs it. So I just kinda wanna play it safe and not lose my Dialga turn one. That would make me very, very sad. And I'd be very, very sad if I lose Diago over here. Or at Diagio. Diagiao. The Gu Gu Gu. That's good damage, very guys. And Fluttermane's KO. Thank you. Alright, cool. Thanks. Appreciate it. Appreciate the AC win, buddy. I do appreciate it. Although I'm not going to appreciate it once you uh, body press me here. Yeah. Yeah, I would not have lived a, a body press if I didn't if I didn't terrestrialize there. I feel Rillaboom's coming in. I feel a Rillaboom coming in right now. Which means I might go into Breaks in here. Breaks in U-turn sounds pretty good right now. Yep, here's Rillaboom. Perfectly fine with this. So I'm going to go ahead and go into Breaks in here. And I'm just going to U-turn out. Into the Rillaboom slot. Racing could actually be really huge here. We don't have protects, remember that, so we kind of have to play like this. We kind of have to like play with our resistances right here. Oh, I love the color on, on breaks in. Yep, there's the fake out. They're going straight for it. Let me U-turn out. I can go into Galate actually. Galate actually looks pretty good here. Yep, there's the body press. Breakson takes that pretty well. Well, not really well, but takes it. That's for sure. Good job, Breakson. Okay. All right. Let's see. I think I just go for a will o on this. And Sacred Sword the uh, Rillaboom. Yep. That was just in case he went for protect. I didn't want to take too much of a too much damage there. He does have protect on it. Instead, he might not have white. He might have white guard, but I'm not sure. Yep, there goes his Rilla boom. Okay, so far so good. So far so good. He can still win this though. We're putting in so much resources into this, and like I said, we don't have protect, so we can't like protect switch. We have to kind of be on the aggressive, on the aggressive side. Okay. That might pose a problem if we don't get rid of it real soon. Yeah, I'll just go for the will o -Wisp on this side anyways. And the Sacred Sword. Could also go for the Psycho Cut. Nah, it's definitely Sacred Sword. He's not Terra Astalizing. Fine by me. Breaks and go ahead. Burn. Do the burning. If it survives, it, it, it's at least not going to do much anymore. Oh, it's not surviving. That Sacred Sword sharpness just hurts. Stab Sacred Sword with sharpness? <laughs> that hurts. Okay, we lose our dude. Now it's Trickroom going down. It's actually important. No, I don't think so. It's pretty, it's, I think it's been... Oh, it has. Wow, okay. That was fast. Wait, did he Draco though? He did, right? Pretty sure he did. Hold on, man. I'm, I'm literally zoning out because of the, the summer heat. Destroying me right now. Let me see. Yeah, it's at minus two. Um, I'm going to Trick Room and I'm going to go into my Rillaboom here. 
This is just to kind of bait it. We, I, I didn't even realize we have three Trick Room users on this team. We have three Trick Room users, my bad. E excuse me. We have three of them. There's the Terra. What are you tearing into? There's the Terra. Steel. Okay, that makes sense why you wanted to get rid of the uh, thing. I can't, I can't hit that. With... Um, anything. Uh, the, so the reason I switched though is because I'm terrified of a crit. If a crit hit me there, I would have been very, very sad. Okay, we've got the uh, trick one back up, which is really nice. I think at this point we just go for hammers and stuff. Because I'm going to go for a fire spin. I know these are not very effective, but I should be able to just whittle it down. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, he's at minus four. I don't think that Latios is going to be able to carry unless he gets like 34 crits. So, yeah, we got we got our first win. That was a little bit of a, you know, a thing when you have no protects. But feels good. We won. All right, GG. Okay, okay. What's our second one? And there's Amazenta team with Rain. It's a Rain team with Amazenta. Okay. I don't know how well Brakeson will do into this besides the Wisp onto the Zamazenta. Because there's rain on the on the other side. I think I still need to go Rillaboom here. And Guard is really good here though. Like really good. Galate is absolutely a monster here. If I can just get rid of the, the Volcarona. I might just do these two instead, honestly. This might be really, really good. And then G Galate in the back for sure. Galate in the back. Galate in the back. Actually, no. No, yeah, we'll, we'll we'll try this. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna bring breaks in again. I wanna try this? I think the 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 last game we were in Blaze too. We were in Blaze uh, territory with that fire spin as well. I, I really wanted to see how much that Blaze would have done on that Larios now. Now that I think about it, because I'm pretty sure we were in Blaze range. Oh, that would have been so cool. I don't know how I feel about this, this though. I'll be honest. Better burn. Yeah, this is what I was talking about. This is kind of like what I was really worried about, but... We might have to Terra our, our dude here. Do we need our Terra for anything else? Kinda. I wonder if faster than... I actually don't know my, my, my speed with this. It's 110, but how fast is the... Uh, the... the Archaladon? That is where uh, I don't know. Okay, we'll put Trick Room up. And we'll go for Snarl. Yeah. He's gonna start ramping up, right? We need a Terra. We need a Terra Grass. We got all the Terra Grasses in the world right now. Just go for a Snarl. Freaking easy. And we're gonna miss. That was actually the most important one to, to miss on. That was actually super important to not miss on. Ah uh, man, why does Snarl always miss? Why does Snarl always miss for me? It's like 90-95% accuracy. Why? Like, come on. My gacha pulls need to be as good as the the, the miss rate on, on, on my on my moves. Yeah, see, so that's why I wanted to do that. And it went for Hurricane. Yeah, we would have taken it way better. And we get confused. Okay, so he misses and then he gets confused. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. 
Okay, we got Trick Room up at least. Um, I'm gonna actually go for a Draco on this slot. I'm gonna go for Draco on that slot. Maybe switch into Brakeson. No, I don't think I want to switch out yet. Then I'm just gonna keep. I'm gonna. I'm gonna like Scald again. Oh, it's slower than us. Under Trick Room. They're both slower. Okay, so Trick Room was actually the. I, I don't know my speed tiers with the Alga. I don't know my speed tiers. I don't know my speed tiers. Now I have to like redo to like, get get rid of it. Mm, that's so bad. It's they're both slower than than Dialga. That's crazy. We're gonna get hit by a body press eventually. Oh, this is bad. Why are they slower than us? They're not on a they're not a trick room team. Why are they slower than us? Why are we faster than them? Why is Suicune... Um, oh wait, no, wait, it makes sense for Sleep Suicune. Okay, that did nothing. Oh my god, why is he... Why is he getting these confusions? Why? Bro, he's faster than, than, than Diaga. Diaga being slower was really rough for me. Diaga being... Like, faster under the trick room is actually screwing me over. I really didn't know that. I really didn't know that. I wish I would have known. Cause I, if, if the algo's faster, then this thing is faster too. It's 100. Base 100. Let's base, that thing has to be to like super tanky or something. But this is like my win con at this point. Does he not have body press then? The thing is, we have steel beam. I need a way to get rid of this Pelipper, and we're we're confused. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do right now. We still have we still have a whole Zamazenta to deal with. We still have a whole Zamazenta to deal with. I don't know what to do. I think we just lose this one then. Yeah, we just lose this one. He's absolutely- oh my god, Braxton took that though. This is so messed up though with the, with the confusions, yeah. That's really bad. That they- That they're fat- they're so, they were fat slower. I didn't know that. Are we not min speed? That might just be the case. Oh, uh, it's all, all because I didn't know. I needed I needed Pelipper out. I needed Pelipper out, and I couldn't get him out because I didn't know I was slower. I'm so sad. I I lose this like a hundred percent. I just lose. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. My controller sometimes bugs out. Yeah, we're... we're their Pelipper is slower than all our Mons. <laughs> I was hoping... I, I was hoping Gallade was, was slower. Oh my god, dude. Why, why are we faster than, than, than the Pelipper? That's crazy. Our own trick room was, was our downfall because we're apparently faster. Most Pelippers are fast, that's the thing. We just happen to run into max... Oh, this is zero IV attack, Diago. There is no min speed anywhere here. Not even the... Uh, not even Gallade is... is, <laughs> is a brave nature. <laughs> I just assumed we were gonna be slower. Oh yeah, we would have we would have been so fine if we weren't we weren't in that in the position that we put ourselves in. Oh well. 
Not to self. We're, no, it's 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 not even my fault here because Pelippers are usually ran fast. Look at his team. Why does he have a fast, uh, a slow, a very min speed slow Pelipper? It makes no sense. It doesn't. It doesn't make sense. It does not make sense. Like if Pelipper was the one that was faster than my team, I would have been fine. But no. Okay. Well, GG. Whoa. Okay. Um. After that horrible experience, what what can we what can we do here? Well, we need trick room up for sure. Oh, no. We. What the heck do we do here? They have they have ways to deal with my trick room, and we'd actually be faster under trick room if they bring hands, which they're most likely going to. We have to we have to bring Tailwind. But our Tailwind being weak to water, uh, Mirada, and this is this is where my other thing was coming coming back about not having high horsepower on Rillaboom. Because we don't have a we don't have a reliable we don't have a reliable way. Um, it's just these two. It's just these two. I feel like Galate is is absolutely needed here. Galate kind of decimates this team if we can uh, ignore the Farigiraf somehow. Because we're going Tailwind, we're not going Trick Room. We're not going Trick Room. We're going Tailwind. We have to go Tailwind. So the only problem is Galate is actually still slower than Miraidon under Tailwind because it's only it would only go to 200 speed while Miraidon is 207. And Diago should still outspeed. Diago is would be one um, would be two uh, two ten. Yeah, so they did, they did go straight for this. Okay, but like I said, I don't have a, a, a absolutely like viable way to, to deal with this right now. I don't even want a Terra. I absolutely don't even want a Terra here. I'm just gonna let it happen. I'm just gonna go for a Tailwind. I'm just gonna fake out the uh, Maridon. Because we, we should be able to take a Freeze Dry. I, I, I definitely don't take whatever this Maridon does to the to the Suicune. And I need I need Tailwind here. Absolutely. I absolutely need it. If he, if he switches out the Maridon, that's fine too. We just make, need to ensure this Tailwind goes up. At least for now. And at the end of the day, we can at least do something about this. Um, this thing later. Is this um, Iron Hands? No, it's this. Okay, that's fine. It was going into the uh, Mirai on slot, anyways. I'm not. I don't really need to worry about this free strike. Yeah, it's not gonna KO me. And like I said, there's no, there's no reason to Terra. I'm Grass Terra, so <laughs> Terraing here wouldn't be a good idea because I knew I was gonna take a free strike. Okay. Uh, we'll go for a Snarl here. Please don't miss this time, Tweekun. That'd be great. And we're just gonna go for a Woodhammer onto this. I feel like they might switch. No, they're not. They're just gonna let me have it. Okay. Okay. Good. We didn't miss this time. Oh, damn. Oh, that's not good. If they trickle, I'm gonna be sad. Okay, they freeze dry that slot this time. It's not gonna KO thanks to the snarl. Yeah, they do trick room. Oh, we don't have protects. We don't have protects. They do trick room. Which is a little bit unfortunate. Okay, we'll go for another snarl. I really wish this we can KO that thing with snarl though. Do you not have special investment? You don't. That's why. Oh boy. Okay, you don't have any special investment. Should have looked at that. Maybe I should have went for Skull then. I needed this. I needed the Snarl. Otherwise, uh, I wouldn't have lived that anyways. I'm gonna go into Diago here. I'm gonna Snarl again. I'm going. I'm gonna go into Diago. Oh boy. The snarl, if the Snarl KO, we would have been completely fine right now. I have to figure out how we're going to deal with this with no protects. That's not going to do enough, so we should be fine there. 
freeze right into that, that's fine. Now it's gonna KO this, yeah. Problem is that we had now we get the KO, but now trick comes up. Problem is nope attacks. No protects, no protects. What do we do? What are you doing? Emerald's back. Thing is, we, we do have Rillaboom still in the back. We have Galate in the back. Trickum's up, Tailwind's up. Even with Tailwind, Galate should still be slower. But we would need to find a way to put it in. We don't have protects. All right, I'm gonna trick him here. Yeah, we'll trick him. While also taking away their their drive, and I'm hoping we live. I mean, the duck is at the little penguin is at minus two. And now they, have, they don't have drive, so we should maybe live? Okay, that's fine. He's probably just gonna double in on that, get back his drive. But now our, now Trick Room's gonna go down for them. Okay, no, that's perfect. Okay, cool. Perfect. Perfection. Yeah, that's fine. Kinda. Go back into Suicune. And going to Galade. Hard swap both of them out here. This 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 duck this pinguino isn't too bad of a threat right now, so I can do this. The only problem is um Yeah. Mira Patel went back up. We have to play with like resistances because we have no we have no way to protect. Okay, hold up, that's that's okay. That's not okay though. Why did he have to crit? Why did they give him a crit? Makes no sense to me. Um, I'm just gonna keep going for snarls here. And since he's lo he low he slowed me down, I'm gonna actually go for trick room here again. Oh, he just went straight for an attack. I thought maybe he would switch out because Psycho Cutter just KOs this. No, that's fine. I'm, I'm actually okay with that. That's perfectly fine for me. Okay, okay, okay. I get, I get Trick Room back up. I'll bring up, bring out the Yaga. And I'm just gonna go for a Steel Beam and like Psycho Cut, I guess, into this. I'm trying to ignore this bundle because I don't. It's not really a threat right now. The only problem is this, uh, this hands. I have to put Trick Room up. But I really thought the hands was gonna leave. I really thought Hans was going to leave or Terra. Because I would have just went for a Sacco Cutter at that point. I mean, I have no choice. I have to kind of take this. These hits. That's not going to be enough. First Power should be able to take it out, though. That thing's at minus three. There's no way the Algot goes down to this little Pinguino, right? He's going for that anyways. Okay, cool. Perfect. 
Perfect, perfect, perfect. I'm ignoring this bundle all the way. I'm going to ignore it all the way. I just have to hope that I don't. Okay. I have to hope I don't miss this. If I miss this, I'm sad. We just. He has to tear out here. He has to tear out. The crystal was actually much stronger here. He absolutely has to tear here, though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for the sacred sword on this slot now. I'm gonna get rid of it now. I'll get rid of their duck. Right here, right now. That is good. That's really good damage. Okay. 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 We're good. We're doing good here. I mean, that's fine. Because at the end of the day, Maridon is now alone, and I don't have to worry too much about it. Because I do have a, I have a, I have a fake alter now, so this should work pretty well for me now. Let's see. Okay, okay. I'll go for a nurse power here, and then I'm gonna go for a fake out, and then this should pretty much, yep, we win. All right, cool. All right, very nice, very nice. GG. Okay, okay, so far so good, and they have a Pikachu. These guys do not like Maridon either. I don't like Maridon either, I don't blame you. Um. So one thing's for sure, I can't stop Aurora Bell going up. Or at least I can, but I, I would have to lose Eliminator here. There's white guard though. There is white guard. I actually bring this. I bring these two in the back. I think that might be my best play. What's with these people and their like obsession with um? What is with these people and their obsession with bringing like half trick room? Never mind. Hold on. I got something better to do here. I wanted to bring breaks in versus this one, but I think breaks in actually has to hold. These are actually the better play here, because I think we go tr we go tailwind instead, not trick room, because otherwise we give it to the uh, Ursaluna and Ursaluna just starts sending it into us. And yes, while we have white guard, they can just um they can just blood moon predicting the white guard. Galade isn't exactly uncommon, so blood moon is very very likely to come into me. All right, let's see what we got here. Yeah, okay. We're faster than this. Yeah, we're going to be faster. Okay. Okay. Do they trick him here? I'm going to go for a wood hammer. I'm just going to for snarl. Yeah. They want to start with their trick room set up. I'm just going to go for this. We're, we're faster than them anyways right now. So we might as well do this. We might as well go for the... Um, for this play. Oh, that did nothing. How much attack do you have, mister? You have ma almost max attack. Okay, that's fine. As long as you don't miss the primary target, Tweakun, because you seem to enjoy missing. I think you need some glasses, my dude. Because you miss a lot. I mean, if we take this out, it's Tweakun that did his job, you know? Now we eat our berry, we num 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 on it, which is nice. Put Trick Room up, okay. That's fine. It's kind of expected. I'm gonna U-turn here. I'm just gonna keep going for Snarls. And he's going for Helping Hand.
That's not gonna KO me. We're good, we're good. Get another Snarl off. Make this Ursa Luna absolutely regret its decision to ever exist. And we can't tear out Diago though. That's for sure. It's a Berry DD, okay. Berry DD. Kitoki do. What do we run into here? <laughs> Funny enough, Galate is actually the restricted here. If you want, if you want to know the truth, I feel like Galate is the restricted here. That's what it feels like, at least. Um, we could go for a Earth Power here. I don't want to. I don't like Steel Beam. I don't like this. It's five percent, ninety-five percent accuracy. Sure, it's one forty, but it's. It doesn't feel good. It does not feel good to hit that button. Like, at all. Is he going for Earth Power here? Yeah, he is. That's a crit. Yeah. That's a crit. There's no way he KOs it otherwise. Even, at my, even, even with Helping Hand, he never KOs it. We just get crit on. We get punished for no reason. We, in, we absolutely got punished for no reason there. He got a KO on our Restricted for no reason. Oh boy. What's what's coming out? Nine Tails, okay. We can't stop the Nine Tails from doing its thing though. Kind of just have to let it happen. Yeah, our, losing our, our restricted there was actually really bad. That was actually really, really bad. This thing doesn't have any, any like, power. We gotta get rid of this somehow. Yeah, the problem is we don't have a way to deal with this. I think we lost because of that. I don't see how we win this now. He went for a helping hand. I could have faked, faked it out. That's so upsetting. Diago going down was actually really bad there. It, it went down too soon. Like way too soon. We still have another turn of Trick Room though. That's the thing here. Yeah, we have another turn of Trick Room. So my, my idea here is I'm going to... I'm going to go for a Sacred Sword onto this slot, and then go for Tailwind. That way I have speak- I still con I continue to have speed control against these. Because it's about to run out. Sh if if Tweakum was slower, there's no way this thing isn't. Okay, now he goes for the follow me. Maybe I should have went for Wide Guard? Why got to play here? No, we get the tailwind off. But oh, we got the tailwind off. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, Moonblast. It's not gonna KO me. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. I think we're still fine here. We now have speed control out of the trick room. Alright, please tell me we have a tarot that can counter this. No. <laughs> no, we don't. <sighs> okay. We uh, we effectively just lose here.
we effectively lose here. My only play here is to go for another Snarl and hope we live it. And KO Ninetales here with a Sacred Sword. That is our only play right now. Because he's going for Blizzard. Okay, nice. Okay, 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 hold on. We can still win, we can still win, we can still win. We can still win. I'm gonna go for a, a, a thingy here. I'm gonna keep going for Skull Snarl. Lower it even further. Lower, lower it, lower it, lower it. Come on. Okay, almost there, almost there. Okay. No freeze, it's nice. Okay, we win. We win. There's no way he wins. He has to be Terror Ice, that's why he's not terroring. I'm going I'm just gonna go for Scald. Let's not even play a game here. Let's not play games here. <laughs> it doesn't even KO, okay. That would have KO'd. And we'll just finish it off with the Oh my god, that was so close. Oh that was so close. I told you Galade was our win con. It wasn't it was not Diago, it was definitely Galade. If if anyone was pulling us through, it's Galade. And lo and behold, Galade definitely pulled us through, and thankfully the Snarls never missed, because if we missed even one Snarl, it was game over for us. Alright, GG. Alright guys, that's going to be the end of the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I think we won all of them. I don't think we lost a single one. Right? Even without Protects, we ended up winning. That just shows Coco made a really, really strong team that doesn't require Protects, but it does stress you out. <laughs> it definitely stresses you out, because you don't have... um. A safety net when you need it kind of just have to take the hits and hope but i mean the the team works really well definitely works really well if someone like me can actually play it considering i love having my protects we never even brought the urshifu who has protect so that is actually very 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 cool so yeah thanks again coco for the um for the team it was really cool breaks and put in a lot of work so did the galate the galate was MVP. Let's be real. Galade was the actual restrict. That it wasn't Diago. It was it was Galade. Suicune did good. It just missed one snarl that kind of could have made the difference, but thankfully it ended up not mattering too much. But yeah, it's missing that snarl. I swear, it's like, can my gacha pulls be this good? Um, can I hit those five percent on the gacha pulls? Because that'd be great. I need my weathering wave um, waifus, man. But anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. The rental and the poke base will be in the description below for you guys to use. Um, what else do I have to say? Oh yeah, make sure to like and subscribe if you guys want to see more VGC rent, uh, content. And if you want to see other Pokemon related content, make sure to be subscribed to my channel. And with that said, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace!